Action! Action! Hi, my name's Dave. And I'm Tammy. Welcome to our YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to share some old video footage with you from two years ago when we were purchasing our RV in 2017. So I apologize in advance for the poor audio quality, but it was shot on my old iPhone with no microphone, no tripods, no nothing. I was just holding my phone, recording the whole thing. We had been looking for a safari trek for a while on the forum, on Craigslist. And we actually found this one three hours from our home and we drove to go look at it initially the first day. We looked at it, decided we wanted it, but the guy was living in it at the time, and so he had to pack up all his stuff, put it in storage, so he needed a few days. So we drove back home um, and then came back out there a few days later to purchase it and um, then drive the RV home. I just wanted to share this video with you guys because it's a momentous occasion for us because it really solidified that we are going to do this and that we were going to be on the road because we got the RV. So it was pretty exciting. It's also the origin story of See My Happiness. This is how we got started. Um, this is the very beginning. So we hope you enjoy it. So we just toured this um, RV that's in Gilroy and uh, we love it. I think it's gonna work. We're on our way to Camping World right now to go get it checked out. They're gonna do a three hour inspection and we'll see how it turns out. I love the tigers on the back. And Dave's in the front with this guy, driving with him. Hope that everything checks out okay at Camping World. Okay, we're at Camping World. I've never been in here, so this is the first for me. I'm dying of anticipation. <laughs> Aren't you? Yeah, I'm really excited. I can't, I don't know. I can't even put it in words. I know, it's so exciting. So there's the trek like behind this RV right there. No, for sure. It's way back there. Anyway, it's in the back. How's it looking? He goes, it, is it looking really good? He said, everything is really clean underneath. That, that the suspension parts that um, Robert said he put on are there. He goes, they're very expensive parts. And so he's he was impressed that they were even on there. And he says the, the P32 chassis, which this is built on, has a tendency to sway in the back. And he goes, there's anti-sway bar in the back. And he goes, that's a very good thing to have on this chassis. He said that the underside is very clean. I did say that the tires are 2010 and would need to be replaced, uh, but he said that's the only negative. And when I told him what we we're gonna, the guy was asking for, he said that's all. <laughs> he said it was a very good price, so uh, we're getting even more excited, and we hope everything else checks out too. Okay, so the inspection turned out amazing. <laughs> We're super excited. The major thing is the tires, but we already knew that they need to be replaced. But the technician said, they're good, but you should replace them. Uh, what we're gonna do now, the RV is still here, so we have to go pick the guy up, have him come back, drive the RV back to the um, RV park, and Dave's gonna work his magic. We're gonna see what we can do. I'm shooting for at least another thousand off to like take take half the price of the, the uh, tires off. So um, hopefully that. But you know what? This is such a good good price and a good rig that I think even if we have to pay a full price, we're going to do it. But hopefully not. We'll see how it goes. Yes.
that fun, babe? <laughs> Are you happy? Can I see your happiness? <laughs> <laughs> We've arrived in Gilroy. We're gonna uh, have breakfast and then head over to the RV park. The RV park's like literally like two minutes away from us. So we're just gonna eat the Sandy's Cafe. So we just finished eating at Sandy's Cafe and I just have to say the service is really good. Um, I had bacon and avocado. So this is Sandy's Cafe. It's pretty cute. It's just this little like diner in Gilroy. And I think it's really cute. You can make any, just about anything keto friendly. So I had to, did a hamburger steak and eggs and just subbed out the hash browns for it with the salad and it was great. Yep. And I, okay, so now we're uh, on our way to the RV park, which is not far at all. And we are getting super excited. Oh, yeah. Oh, hopefully he's emptied everything out of the RV. Um, and is ready to go. I'm not sure what that's gonna be like, but we'll find out. It doesn't really matter. If he needs help packing, we can always help him when we get there, because that would be helpful for him, I'm sure. And we're here. We're here, we're here, we're here. We are the proud new owners of a 2001 Safari Trek. Yes, Yay! we are. Uh, everything went so smoothly. Robert was a great guy to deal with. Uh, we got it emptied out. And now we're about ready to head home. It's uh, been a wonderful experience and I can't wait for the rest of our life here uh, traveling around in a safari truck. See you later. Bye. Bye. waiting for Dave now. Here he is. Oh my gosh, this is so incredibly exciting. Okay, so we just had lunch. Stupid Surrey always starts talking when I start recording. So, I think we are going to go ahead and buy this one. He seems pretty good about it. We're working for what the price when we get back. Dave's trying to figure out the lock here. I mean, it's just the, <laughs> the deadbolt. It's lock. So, as you can hear, his stuff keeps falling in the back and I'm worried we're destroying this guy's house. I heard something fly and fall off and I'm worried that we broke one of his coffee mugs or something. Are you scraping something? I think you're scraping the tree. I just wanna make an announcement that my husband had these garlic pickles last night for a snack and our whole bedroom smelled like garlic and he still smells like garlic. It's like oozing from his pores. It's just horrendous. So we're chewing gum and he's chewing gum and 
It's got the peppermint spray going, but it still reeks of garlic. But luckily the place we're going to, the RV park, is called the Garlic Farm. So I think this guy is probably going to be used to the smell of garlic. Okay, so here it is. The dogs are just so excited about this RV. Karma got so excited she actually already peed in it, so I had to mop the floor already. Good thing it has hardwood floors.